Hi, welcome to me inserting myself in a category I have no business being in, the beauty world. I mean, I'm freaking gorgeous, but I know nothing about beauty products, but that's why we're gonna test I think I have four, four beauty products today. I'll just introduce them real quick. We'll do this one last, but it is a, a nose wax kit. Uh, we also have a, a foot file, this makeup brush cleaner, and an otoscope. This is something you stick up into things to see things. I closed my door, how did you get in here? I closed my door and Blaze somehow manages to get in every time. It's a scope, you stick in your ear and stuff. I don't know, we're just gonna figure it out. Ready, let's go test some stuff. Okay, this is the Lux Beauty Products Adjustable Speed Electric Makeup Brush Cleaner System. I just realized I don't have makeup brush cleaner, so I'm gonna have to do like that dish soap water hack that I've tried before. This seems so intense. Oh good, they gave me cleaner. Praise baby Jesus. Let's do things. Now I never clean my makeup brushes. Does anyone? Besides like beauty gurus when they tell you to do it? Step one, for water soluble makeup. I don't know what water soluble makeup, I don't know if mine are water soluble or not. I don't even know what that word means. Pour some water in the bowl, squeeze in a small amount of soap, about four milliliters. Like I know what a milliliter is. Oh, if you are not sure if your makeup is water soluble, first try it with water and soap. And if it's still not clean, do it again with our cleanser. All right, I'm gonna go put water and some soap into this. Okay, so what you do is you find a rubber thing that fits your brush. This is my bronzer brush. There's lots of bronzer still on that, great. You insert it into this. What is happening? This is so gross. It's like a f muddy fish bowl. Keep the brush underwater while gently moving it up and down for approximately 10 seconds, okay? Gradually lift the brush out of the water while still sprinting, allowing the brush to spin dry. Oh my gosh. That was like extremely satisfying. Okay, I'm gonna wipe it. This is so gross. That was all bronzer. <laughs> okay, there is still a little bronzer left on it, but I'm telling you this was filthy. I never clean it. The only time I've ever cleaned my brushes is on camera for videos, but a lot less is coming off. Clearly it came out. That is ridiculous. Now I'm just gonna let this dry. That worked. Okay, and so the stand, so you plug this USB thing into the stand and you plug this into an outlet of some sort, and then you can charge this. Okay, that's, this is difficult to do. Don't turn on, don't turn on. Hold on, I can't get this in its, there it is. That was, that was difficult. But so this just sits and charges. This comes with different size rubber thingies to fit different brushes. Like that goes to that one. That one could also go to that one. So you never know. You just never know. So there's different size holders. You're gonna have to clean this out several different times because it's gonna get gross. Also, it dries it really well. Like, I feel like I could use this in an hour. You know sometimes when you do it yourself, it takes forever to dry? This dried quick. Look at that. Ah! <laughs> okay, actually, you know what we should do? See if it works on my foundation brush with the makeup brush cleaning solution because I feel like that's gonna be a thing. Let's try that. Let's try, why not? All right, we're just doing a little solution. And then, which one does this fit on? I feel like I'm gonna have to do this brush, okay? Do this, soak you in for 10 seconds. Hit the button, look at us go, look at us go. All right, I'm gonna bring it out. Do you see that? Ho, 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 ho! Smells good. There is still a lot of foundation on that. It says if the makeup like doesn't come off to do it again, so here we go. There was a lot of foundation on this. It's like magic. Ha! Ah, this was a flat brush. So much foundation is still coming off. Okay, I don't know if I trust this to get liquid makeup off. I'm glad we tested this. So the bronzer's just powder. So I'm sure like blush, bronzer, eyeshadow, definitely can get it off, but look at how much foundation is still coming out. And this is using their cleaning stuff. Okay, I'm gonna keep working on it, see how much I can get it done. Cause I, I don't think it's good. I think it might not be good with liquid. That's unfortunate. All right, well, you know what? It cleans your powder, but I'm gonna say cleaning the bowl in between each one is definitely a hassle. I mean, it might not get as gross if you your brushes are clean constantly, but mine definitely are not. I can still see that there is foundation all over it. I think this is good if you like little tools like this. Maybe I have to soak it for longer, but I don't think it's got, gonna be that great for um, liquid makeup. I'm not a beauty expert though, but that's just, that's my opinion. I feel like this is something you're gonna have to run under water and get one of those like scrubby things for and really get going. I don't think spinning this in a fish bowl for 10 seconds is gonna is gonna do the job. And that's, that's what I think about that. All right, next product. All right, let's try this foot file. I don't know 
why. It just, I bought it because it looks like a switchblade and I was like, I wanna try that. My feet have been on the internet quite a lot. I am rated highly on wiki feet. I usually try not to show my feet, but we're gonna have to show them. But also I love this. Oh, I love this. Because you know, you know when you're like looking through your like, your, your stuff, you get the file and then you touch the, oh, you touch the file. And I hate that, hate that feeling of touching the file. You don't have to touch it. <gasps> oh, look at it. You don't ever have to touch the file. All right, now let's see how it works. This is my foot, I have ugly feet. So here's the before. Focus on the before, great. Now let's grate my foot. I can just, I can see the skin coming off. Oh God. Oh, oh my gosh, my foot's really soft. What? <gasps> it is so soft. I am blown away. It doesn't look that great, but it feels fantastic. <gasps> I'm like in love with my own foot right now. I've never been in love with my own feet. I'm gonna do this every freaking day. No, I won't. I will forget this exists in like three days. But everyone go file your foot. Go file your foot. It's so soft. I'm in love with this. Okay, how do you clean that though? How do you clean that? Their skin just flying around. I hope everyone knows that. Do you just run it underwater? Well, act like you just run it underwater. <gasps> mm, this product's amazing. This is a foot file. It's extra. It's disgusting. But if you hate touching a file, hate touching a file, done. Done. Deal. Yes. Okay, next product. Okay, the Otoscope. This is for like looking ears and noses. Cause like, I know it might not go with beauty, but it does. It does. Cause sometimes we need to know what's going on in those noses and those ears and whatnots. Okay. I am so intrigued. Do I have to download an app? Of course I do. <gasps> okay, I'm gonna download all of this and then we'll go inside my ear. Blech. Okay, I'm screen recording right now. So we're gonna go. Oh. That is terrifying. Holy crap. That is absolutely terrifying to look at. Okay, here we go. I feel, I feel wrong. I feel like that is something I should never look at and I should never see. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's go in the next, the other ear. That, I, this just feels wrong. It feels wrong to look in. Oh, let's go up my nose. That's a boogie, okay. Ah, okay, okay, what's the other nostril? That's a lot of snot. There's not a lot of room in here. There's not a lot of room in here for activities. How's my finger get up here? <coughs> God, can we do it for the look in the back of my throat? Yes, this has gone. <laughs> it's gone in my ear, in my nose. Oh. Oh. This is disgusting. Disgusting. Why did I purchase this? Also, look how close I can get to my pores. This is what this is for. You see all my wrinkles? Hold on. Look at, that's my skin. Oh, I got a hair there. This is terrifying. I'm obsessed with this. What can I look at? Hold on, this is also just really good to look up close on things. Ear. I'm obsessed with this camera. This isn't even for like things. Oh, hold on a sec. Oh wait, I'm supposed to attach stuff to this? What is this? I'm supposed to put this on this? What's happening? Let's go in my ear. Oh, it's so I can push my ear around. I got pretty clean ears. Let's just talk about that. My ears are pretty clean. There's not a lot of crazy happening in here. Like I expected a little more like gross, but they're actually decent. That's it for this. So if you have a desire to look in your ears or nose or up close to like on other things, you need a tiny little camera. I'm gonna say the camera was way better than I expected. Like I thought I was gonna be really crap. I honestly didn't expect this to work. I thought it was gonna be pretty lame, but the camera was actually really good and, I, and there was a good light on it. I wasn't expecting this to actually be decent. It was pretty easy to set up as well. You just connected the Wi-Fi. This was a great product and I'm shocked by it. Wow. All right, to our last product. All right, the last one today. My nose waxing kit. I do trim my nose hairs, but I haven't trimmed them in like a week. So I should, and I doesn't trim everything. So I should be good to use this. So let's test it. I see a lot of people on TikTok trying these. You just, you stick it up your nose and you go. They give you fake mustaches. 
2012 me would have loved this. Here we go. Put five grams around 100 beads or bead covers on the bottom of a paper cup, okay? Should I count them out? What looks like 100 to you guys? That looks like 100, right? Okay, so you put 20 milliliters of water into this, put this in this, put this in the microwave for 60 to 90 seconds so the wax is fully melted. Oh, these are mustache protectors. So in case you don't want to get the hair on your lip, like if you're a guy and you have a mustache or if you're a girl and like your mustache, that's up to you. Dip the stick in it, rotate it, stick it up your nose, leave it there for one to two minutes and then pull it out. Wow, all right, let's go heat this. Okay, so we've melted this. You have to dip it in. Rotate the tip applicator in the wax to get an appropriate amount of wax. Done. And then you stick it up your nose. This is gonna hurt, it's hot wax. God, I don't wanna do this. I don't feel like that was enough wax. I have a large nostril. Okay, I'm supposed to sit here for one to two minutes. It's a long time. I'm already bored. All right, see you in a minute. Okay, because I'm a giant baby, I haven't listened to my girlfriend to pull this out of my nose. You're supposed to pull <laughs> It's gonna hurt. Okay, I have the hole in my nose and then you pull it out. I'm so nervous. I'm so nervous. Okay. Are you supposed to hold it your nose? <laughs> it takes like two seconds. That's painful. Come on. Okay. Go! Oh, God, that was oof! Ew. Ew. Ew! Okay, it wasn't as bad as I expected. It was more shocking than anything else. It didn't feel like little tiny, like you know how like when you accidentally pull a nose hair or something, it hurts like it stings? It wasn't that, it was very much like a thick tug and not like little tiny hairs. That is disgusting. I'm so happy. Oh, how's you look? Okay, I mean, I gotta do the other side now. It's just, that's just the rule. There we go. All right, see you back in my office. So it's been about two minutes for this one, two, three. Oh God, no, you're supposed to hold your nose. 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 One, two, three. Oh, that would hurt more. Have someone else do it. It is way easier if you have someone else do it than you do it yourself. Holy, okay. I definitely got some good stuff with that. Oh, wow, I got up there. Oh, look at that, no hair in sight. There might be a boogie. That also might be wax. Oh, it feels so weird in there. Okay, well, that works. All right, is that everything? Oh, what do we do? The foot file was amazing. The brush cleaner was great on powdered, on powder makeup brushes, not liquid makeup brushes. The telescope camera thing was really great. I read it's helped to help uh, get earwax out of baby's ears. Like that's what these little things are for, is to scrape out uh, the earwax. So that's great. And the nose stuff definitely works. <sighs> Follow the instructions. It took me um, a little extra time to microwave it, to melt it fully, but that's totally fine. I think I used more than 100 beads. But anyway, wow. Okay, I'm gonna sign off now. I love you guys so much. Those were all four, those were four good beauty products, right? Yeah, all right, that works. Um, I love you guys so much. Please subscribe and see videos every Tuesday and Thursday on this channel. Like this video if you liked it. Um, and if you don't like it, then you can get a paper cut and eat some salty french fries and on your fingers and then it stings a lot. So there's that. I love you. You're beautiful. Make sure you check out my podcast channel and my vlog channel. I posted a new vlog with Jojo. And, oh, and a podcast with Jojo. Jojo's on both of those things. If you want to see Jojo and girlfriend and Kai, go check those things out. I love you guys so much. You're wonderful. You're beautiful. And I'll see you next time. Bye.